whatever moment comes in the spring balance. Okay, so spring balance reading we will be studying. Now you will also uh, draw this observation table. So you use your rough copy in which you will write this observation table. Where what will we do when we start uh, taking the What is initial tension mentioned here? So that we will note down. Then distance of string from pin y. This we will have this distance. This distance is y. So now our moment equation is moment about O is this is our moment equation w1 into x1 plus w2 into x2 plus w3 into x3 equals to t into y. It's whatever tension we are getting into that y distance. Okay. So this is how we are going to uh, see. Now we are W1, W2, W3. So initially we will take only one row. Okay. Then next uh, we will take, we will add one more row. And for this we will add one more row. This total three rows will be there. So corresponding distance we have to measure. X1, X2, X3. So we will measure it there with the X, uh, apparatus. Then we will see the corresponding readings. What are the readings? In the spring. Okay. When you add some more, then what is that uh, spring reading? That will see. Then we will calculate effective tension in spring. So effective tension is T2. So whatever reading we got with the addition of flow rate, minus we have the initial tension. So we will get this table and here then we will find out the trending moment. So trending moment is nothing but whatever load into perpendicular distance. So that moment we will be calculating and finally we will also have the restoring moment which is nothing but that uh, this uh, T into Y. This value will be there. And once we do this, a very important thing is we will find out what is, what is the percentage error. Okay, what is the percentage error that we will calculate? So, percentage error is nothing but whatever our correct value minus estimated value by correct value. So, how to calculate this? That I will tell you. Okay, when we do the observation part. Okay, so I want you to uh, write down the table now initially. So here a very important point that initially this instrument should be in equilibrium. Okay. So what happened there? There is you know some error in this scale. So what I have done? I have added some weights over here so that you know it is it is uh, at some you know equilibrium condition. And how do we check that? We have to also see that this paper is you know, it should pass free over here. So the setup is ready now. We will not include these loads because this is contributing in equilibrium setup. Okay. Now what we will do? Here we will add any one load. Okay. So uh, let's add one load here. This is one kilo load. Okay. I am applying it here. There is some change here. So we have to again bring this setup in equilibrium and then take the reading. But I did not tell you before. We have to take initial reading. Okay. So please see this is in kg. What, what you can see? It's 2 kg. Yeah. Okay. So note down T1 is 2 kg. Now after that reading I am applying 1 kg load here. After 1 kg load, then we have to again, we have to see that this paper should pass freely, but it is at much high level. So, I want someone to please uh, check this part of the paper, uh, where you know I am trying to bring it little low. Yeah, please check if it is, uh, it should not uh, totally go down because again one reaction will come here. So, that should not happen. Is it fine or should I try it?
now you measure it. Or can you please make the scale? So it is showing 31 centimeter. Please write down 31 centimeter. This is x1. Okay, so w1 is 1 kg and it is 31 centimeter. Okay. Now uh, this is that. So our first side is second step. Now you add one more row. Okay. So first side is done. Now let's add one more weight. So again one more weight is there. So I am adding it at this distance. This is W1. This is W2. Now take the second row. Okay. In that you will write W1 is already same 1 kg but one more W2 which is one more kg is added. Now I want you to please uh, check the reading and do the adjustment which is come up here. So in this way we will be actually adding First load, second load, third load, and then do the calculation. Okay? Yeah. 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 So now how to W two? So first load is one kg. Second load is one kg. Third load is one kg. Now we are saying twenty four centimeter. This is for X two. So X one is thirty one and twenty four. Now I want one more student to come. Now we are taking third reading. Please uh, add one uh, load here. It is uh, what is the weight? We add the weight for W one kg. This is one kg. Yes. So no, this is five hundred grams. Now they, she added so five hundred grams. So now again you have to bring it in equilibrium. So this is Okay. 